Hello my friends and subscribers, my name is Alexander Stepanov. Just watch this video to the end and you will know how to apply the edge shape of the nail. And also you will see a lot of tricks and uh, details about nail extensions. This video is very long, I tried to make it maximum detailed and informative. Here we go! Hello my friends and subscribers. My name is Alexander Stepanov. How are you doing? Today we have the great mood because we will do fantastic shape of nails. This is the age shape of nails and it will always amaze me and, and amaze my clients. For the first time I applied this shape seven years ago it was something like adventure for me it wasn't easy but the result was stunning it's something it was something incredible and uh, a lot of clients still keep on doing this shape of shape of nails and they're happy to have this one but sometimes I don't understand them because it's not easy to live with such shape of nails and um, even uh, I noticed that people who live with such shape of nail they are something like they are special they have a sense of humor they're happy and uh, on the thumbnail you saw woman and uh, you saw also the uh, the dress or the costume costume she wears and uh, this is the special the special wear for the celebration on the kindergarten and uh, she also asked me to to create the shape of nails and the color of nails that will be suitable for this for this uh, for this dress and uh, now you see me proceeding with rolling down cuticles I have already removed uh, the hard gel using the barrel gel bead this item always helps me to do my work fast and as you can see I'm using only high quality uh, tools and products for example drill beads they made in Russia not in China I don't sell Chinese products at all and uh, you can be sure that these uh, tools will work for you for a long time and uh, you will be happy with them and you will you will order more and more times this amazing drill bits this is the flame drill bit from natural pieces of uh, diamond and uh, it's long living one I can suggest you to take and try this one and uh, then I'm proceeding with uh, shaping nails with a nail file of 100 grid a lot of commenters said that it's not okay to work with natural nails using the low grid file of course I agree with you guys especially when you need to uh, ref uh, remake nails again and again I mean uh, after removing the all surface of gel but in the other case I hope you understand guys when we need only uh, only uh, sharp or only shape the small area in the in the cuticle in the cuticle line the small area the area which nail grows and we we see this surface when we need only to shape this area it's okay to take not new I can say again not new the file but this file can be uh, can be uh, belongs can be belong to a particular uh, particular client 
and you can uh, prepare the nail plate using this one um, file with the, uh, for example, with the 100 grit. But of course, if you take the new file of 100 grit and start sharpening uh, the nail plate, it's awful, it's not okay and uh, you should be careful because uh, you can uh, not only destroy the nail plate, you can also make some bleedings. Um, so, especially for uh, the natural nail plate, you should take the higher grid file, for example, with uh, 100 and for, for 50, 50 grid or higher so be careful with it uh, and I think that some of my mm, subscribers had misunderstanding because I always shape the cuticles area with that file and um, in some case uh, where wh when uh, the client for example work with water and I can allow myself to prepare the nail plate with the lower grid file but not in all cases uh, I can repeat that I can repeat that thing you should use only a higher grid file for um, for natural nail plate you see me working now with uh, the gel primer and the beige gel these surfaces uh, help help us to um, prepare nail plate to the maximum from liftings and uh, it also will help you when you, you will be removing the product when apply infill of gel nails so we don't need to remove the whole product because uh, you try tra you try tra traumatize the nail plate this way and uh, the the um, our products are uh, perfect enough they have good quality and uh, they they are not spoiled of, uh, in time we don't need to remove these products uh, all, all the surface all, all this product so guys, now you see me working with the sculpting mix gel, and as you can see, I've worked with this product for a long time, and day by day, client by client, I use only one or two types of uh, this gel. Um, I can explain, guys, why do I choose this one? Uh, the the matter is that. I saw that uh, women al always prefer the nude color, nude colors, nude shades of colors. This is the first. Uh, it's easy to work with this gel when you apply the infill, so you don't need to remove all product, as I told before. And what else? Uh, it doesn't burn the nail plate at all. I, I know the problem when we are using uh, the clear types of gel no matter what is the brand the clear gel will always burn the nail plate my clients don't have this problem so you can be sure that this gel will not give you any problems with um, hurting the nail plate or spoiling uh, the nail plate with heating so you can be sure that this is uh, you will have no problems and all clients that all customers who ordered this type of gel, no one said that uh, it burned the, uh, this product burns the nail plate extremely. It's we have no problems with it. So you can be sure that uh, the, it's easy to work with this pro with these products. Um, as you can see, after applying uh, the Sculpting Mix Gel, I'm using uh, the thick base gel. Um, what for? It's easy to create uh, the edge, the edge line, and, and, easy, and easy to cover 
uh, all gaps or surfaces where we don't have product. So uh, this is uh, for saving your time, and because we don't have, we don't need to shape nails uh, for a long time after covering them with the with the gel, and you can use all uh, the brush like that from the gel polish or the gel primer, so it's easy to work. I think, guys, we can uh, we can create something in our work and I, I think that our profession uh, our our profession is perfect that we can uh, create something do something new create an amazing nail designs change technique uh, to the better uh, for I think it's for uh, for people for nail technicians uh, because we, we have to fa uh, save our time for work and uh, get more clients and as you can see I have uh, already uh, applied this uh, base, uh, th a thick base gel on all nails we cure it in lead lamp about one minute and now you see me working with the barrel gel bit again and comparing uh, the length of one nail with the length of the other nail it's necessary guys uh, it's necessary guys that uh, the length of each nail should be the same and now you can see that uh, we work with the barrel gel bead no, on, no, on, not only for in the beginning of the process we work with this drill bit all the time why do I apply this thing because uh, we have to remove the large amount of gel from the side walls and if we uh, if we work with the nail file in this case uh, you will you'll have to you'll have to uh, you have to spend more energy, more power, and you will be tired after working with the file. But using the barrel, you can see it's uh, it's very very fast uh, to do the shape of nails, and it's easy. So I have a lot of pressure, uh, ple uh, pleasure, <laughs> to work with such uh, such tool. And as you can see, we, we, we can spend only uh, 10 or 20 minutes to apply the shape of nails without any problems using, for example, nail files. And what can, what can I say about the sculpting mix gel more? It's easy to work with this product because it, it's easy to shape. You know, sometimes you can buy the gel, uh, which is hard like a stone, and um, it's not easy to work with, it's not easy to shape or file this nail, not only f with uh, the, uh, the nail file, but with, uh, the, um, with drill bits. But the Sculpting Mix gel, doesn't have such problems it's like a butter i mean uh it can be shaped or filed like a butter but is but this product is also strong like a stone and uh, of course it's better to apply the uh, larger amount of product in the stress zone especially when the length of the nail is um, is long like you see on the video in these cases we should apply the stress zone right on the place between uh, the natural nail and uh, the length uh, the free edge of the nail and as you can see when we uh, when we shape these nails uh, we have to we have to do it 
following the scheme and at first we can uh, we should uh, repeat uh, we should repeat uh, from side walls to edges to sides from uh, shape the product from the lower side and so guys let's um, come back to the dust collector you asked me about this uh, equipment many times I think that when we when we, when you work with such uh, shapes of nail when you apply long nails it's necessary to to use uh, the the dust collector which removes the dust uh, and uh, fragrances of products outdoors because it's not good when when your room is full of dust because it's not good for your health for me, for your long long uh, please correct me if i mistake i mean nail technicians especially pedicurists who work with, uh, with the dust and don't use special dust collectors they always have problems with their health and um, it's better to protect yourself using all types of uh, protecting stuff like face masks, uh, drill machine with the dust collector. I, I mean, when when we apply the pedicure. And one of my friend, nail technicians, uh, had a lot of practice working as a pedicurist and, and uh, the nail touch without using any dust collectors when she start started uh, doing gel, gel polishes you know it was fashionable to to do gel polish they told that that was great and uh, they is earned uh, she she earned a lot of money and got a lot of clients uh, she got one client per hour and she said that that was great and after two or three years of war after working she had problems with their with her lymph uh, allergy asthma a lot of problems and uh, that's that's right and uh, it's uh, logical you should uh, always think about your health because you this this industry this uh, profession it's not maybe it's not healthy sometimes especially when you forget about protecting yourself and I can repeat to any uh, begin to every beginner that you should always remember to protect your back to sit on the chair correctly make pauses between clients uh, apply special exercises fitness anything else because sometimes when you start working everything th seems uh, good for you and you don't have any problems with your back for example but after five or six years um, one day you have terrible pain in your back you go to the doctor do a mer MRT um, and the doctor says that uh, you have big problems with with your back and sometimes people go to operations uh, and they have to they have to 
forget about their, their favorite deal, their favorite professions. So I can repeat guys that it's necessary to protect yourself, especially when you work with large numbers of clients. For example, my brother Andrew, his hands now in the uh, in this in the screen. And so guys, let's come back to the process. As you can see, Andrew have applied uh, the shape on the other one hand and proceeding with the other hand. As you can see, it's not easy to work with it. it uh, you should be strong enough and uh, here you should have strong hands to work with the shape of nails. It, sometimes some, for some nail technicians it seems very easy but when they start doing this work uh, uh, when they start doing these nails uh, after after one hour they have tired and they want they want and they want to stop this this deal but you know after a long time of work of uh, about 10 years or more it seems much easier than than when you begin this uh, this deal sometimes uh, when I see uh, manufacturers uh, who works in the streets for example when I visit uh, foreign countries it seems like it seems like they do their works so easy and it sometimes it's it seems that uh, you can sit down and uh, for and work and the same way uh, but <laughs> you can be sure that this work uh, takes a lot of time a lot of knowledge practice yeah. so the next one the next one drill bit is the cone drill bit I'm in love with this one because uh, when I start doing nails I don't have this type of drill bit and I had to work have to experiment with different types of uh, drill bits to remove the gel uh, in from underneath of the nail plate as you can see on the video and especially when I applied the edge shape of nails uh, it, it was very hard because this is the special shape and we can remove gel only using this one you will uh, you will never do the same using the other gel bit because as you can see the cone gel bit has the special shape which is uh, useful for this this work so i'm happy that i have uh, that that i found this amazing drill bit and that's great that we have that all that nail technicians all over the world now have a chance to buy these products from Russia, from my uh, nail store. You know, uh, shipping takes about one or two weeks um, in about 18, 80, 80 persons, persons of delivering in the other uh, 20 persons it takes about uh, one month uh, but sometimes uh, it's it's especially for uh, the long distance for example Australia New Zealand other places but sometimes in Australia package goes one or one week not more it depends on what it depends on uh, on custom sometimes custom delay our packages but you can be sure that you are protected anyway if uh, we face with any problems I always can send the other another package for you if you lost uh, products if you don't get package or refund uh, all uh, soon for for your order you, you shouldn't be worried about it because you work with the professional which uh, uh, the professional who uh, 
uh, who cares about his uh, image, about his uh, reputation. So I think it it's good to to when we have a relationship like customer and uh, the seller and this is the great experience for me that I have I have a chance to sell products for you and now you see me working you see my brother working with uh, the ball drill bead and um, this helps him to remove the cure, uh, the dead skin after the process of, of filing nails uh, and shaping nails. So it's better to to work with uh, the dry skin in the end of the process because in the beginning the skin is wet and when you use um, the ball drill bit you can hurt the skin because it's wet now you see my brother using the the wipe the large wipe uh, why do we use uh, this type of wipes because uh, the tack layer can cause allergic reactions and the large uh, surface of wipe protects us from this allergy from this uh, from products which can put which can be put it on the skin <laughs> okay guys now I'm using the drill uh, I'm using the drill polish of cherry wine color and um, this gel, gel polish has cat eye effect so you can use the other one gel, brand of gel polish on uh, sculpting mix gel it's no matter all types of products will stay on the same way and uh, I think it's not the the problem, the big problem, if uh, it happens that you don't have this type of gel gel polish. I don't have this one in my store now, but soon I will provide you with the, these amazing colors. Uh, we will we'll use magnet for creating cat eye effect, and this effect is uh, the, this effect looks great especially on H shaped nails as you can see my brother is using now uh, the brush number zero zero for drawing lines in hidden places and now it's uh, it's in trend to apply the product under the cuticles cuticles or very close to cuticles and I think you already saw uh, a lot of works of Russian nail technicians who always apply product on the cuticles and it it looks wonderful and, uh, it tracks uh, heads of a lot of nail touches from all over the world because Russians now are doing very clean manicure very uh, uh, very elegant nail designs or on short or on long nails and I think that uh, Russians Ukraines are one of the best nail technicians in the world now because the, their works very popular in Instagram, in social networks, and they don't use Photoshop on their works. 
and uh, many of them don't use Photoshop be because they they prove the world like their works are clean enough and uh, the manicure is perfect when they do videos of their works and as you understand it's not easy to to correct uh, mistakes or faults made uh, that the nail touch made on nails when you use video uh, and when you make uh, the the short video clips of your work of the result of the work but some nail technicians uh, are still publishing photos and correct them using the Photoshop in my videos I always try to make video shots of uh, my works but this time my brother Andrew uh, my brother Andrew forgot to make video shots of their works because he used to make for take photos of of the result and in the end of the video you will see the result on photos unfortunately but he made a lot of photos and uh, if uh, if he needed if he need to correct them he she should spend a lot of time and he never correct corrects his works uh, because he doesn't need it as you can see he work he works uh, he works uh, a lot and he has a lot of clients per day he's professional and I'm so proud of him and now you see him working with the magnet uh, she or sorry he is placing the magnet from from different sides of the nails and creating the uh, this um, cat eye effect she oh sorry he he does it randomly and the result is perfect of these nails as you can see the color is beautiful and uh, these nails will will be suitable for this client and she's very very happy uh, with this color she agreed with this uh, video to publish this video on youtube and her photo of her dress uh, her beautiful dress what do you think about this nail design what do you think about her style and what do you think about this uh, kind of this type of people funny crazy people who always try to uh, to make something something special in their lives please let me know down in the comments as you can see I have uh, covered nails with the holographic uh, top gel top gel it's also available in my store please guys uh, if you like this video, if you want more uh, long videos like that, please click like, subscribe to my channel and uh, write down your thoughts about my video down in the comments. So, as you can see, we're applying the last nail and uh, let's take a look on the result. I think these nails are special elegant and suitable for this woman and uh, what do you see on the nail uh, i mean the painting let me know in the comments see you next time bye